Hello and welcome. Again, I'm grateful for um, the guidance I'm getting. It's like it just continues, you know. Some, it's like puzzle pieces presented to me, and um, someone else present these puzzle pieces in in ignorance almost or it's like did they know what they just said and uh, I mean someone presenting something to me and um, kind of missing the point again and but did it miss the point or or maybe it just knew everything and it just wanted to tell me anyhow to the topic of of, of today the topic is let's let's explain freemasonry artwork through the origin of freemasonry freemasonry itself and proving this point in a convincing way uh, what I mean is my previous reasoning about the limestone and the fact that Jacob's Jacob's ladder and the dream of Jacob in the Bible um, I have assumed something to be like it is limestone it's 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 not my assumption it is limestone that's a fact according to the bible you know but what i'm interested in here is to see from another perspective you know it never hurts so with a blank sheet Let's prove the point of Masonic artwork using the Stone of Destiny as as um, as the object of uh, proof proof here. Let's start from there and let's see where it gets us. So first of all. It is. Um, this is. <clears throat> this is a stone used in coronation. You can see the throne. So when a new king is uh, throned in in uh, Great Britain. So that is also England and and all of these different countries there. Um, they go to Scotland and they have. Uh, the ritual there for for the throning because it's the stone of destiny and it's it's the supposed Jacob's pillars pillar stone pillow sto stone his pillow stone which he had under his head when he dreamt about the uh, the ladder to heaven met Jesus Christ and so on you know so this stone went its way to to Scotland somehow this is this is the official uh, history of where it comes from and uh, what do I think about it well I think it's fake but I think the stone itself is fake. This is, but 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 it still has a huge 
implication and meaning and especially metaphorical value here because as you will see it ties together with something really important first of all here you can see the coronation of the latest uh, king there in England right and um, so stone of scone and you can see coincidentally that scone is a slang term for head usually referring to the crown region this is coincidental scone scone in scotland is as i understand it's a place called scone so you see these coincidences stack up you see uh, google will also say that scone is a person's head so you see stone <clears throat> stone of the head already there stone of the head that is the stone pillow of Jacob uh, in his dream you know so the major thing here is that this is about Scotland and the world's first Freemasonic lodge was in Scotland 1599 okay and you can ask yourself why why Scotland well I believe it's the stone stone of scone that's the reason and it's it's the connection to it's the especially the metaphorical connection to Jacob's Jacob's pillow stone you know it wasn't really it wasn't really his pillow he was he was falling asleep on his spiritual altar of 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 the pearl of his mind you see and so this is why this is why it's important that the first Freemasonic Lodge is in Scotland it fits it fits to the rid riddle of reality and it also explains the artwork of Freemasonry why do they focus on Jacob's ladder well the reason is their origin their logical or origin remember remember what I told you Freemasons doesn't know about limestone about the importance of limestone even though that's their origin with the freestone limestone carving you see that's their origin but they don't know about they, they they just see it like this okay maybe they they know like they they, they know that the first Freemasonic Lodge was in Scotland and they have the stone of um, destiny right and the stone of destiny represents Jacob's ladder or, or his his pillow right people need logical rational explanations and this is a logical rational explanation to their to the origin of of uh, their artwork why do they have the artwork of Jacob's ladder well this is why if you are a rational logical person you know but I know that there is something more about this right there are more things about this this, this is more metaphorical me metaphorical but it's true also right you can see it for yourself here it's obvious right so 
finally someone said it right why did I say it well it's the stone of the head you know the stone in the head the living stone Pretty clear everything, right? It's pretty clear. <laughs> okay, let's end it here. Have a good day. Bye.